Hey guys, welcome back to more My Hero Season 3. So last episode, um, Deku and the squad are on their way to save Bakugo, but they can't be seen in public because of the UA incident, so yeah. they got disguises. Um, they're in hot water right now because they're not supposed to be on this mission. Like, as far as the pro heroes know, they're in the hospital, at they're at home. Like, the pro heroes are supposed to be handling this. Mm -hmm. they're, they're the ones that are supposed to be saving Bakugo. But, you know, they're the homies. They can't just sit by and let Bakugo be taken away. So that's why they're on this mission right now. Yeah. And, yeah. Um, it's just not looking good. It's not. If they get caught, it's bad for all the good guys. Pretty much, because... The public's already not with the heroes. They're mm -hmm. not with UA. If they get caught, UA's reputation goes even further down the drain. Yeah. And it's not gonna look good for the pro heroes because it's like, yo, your sidekicks, like not even sidekicks, these students that are under your watch are doing this. Mm -hmm. You know, and it's like, it's not gonna look good. So anyways, can't wait to see what's gonna happen next and how the squad's gonna handle this. And with that being said, let's get on with this video. You spoke about keeping the students safe, Eraserhead. But according to our information, you encouraged them to fight during the attack on the training camp, putting them in grave danger. What was your reasoning for this? So they don't get killed? That because we didn't know the full situation, the boy is obviously strong and heroic. On the other hand, the violence he displayed in the final <laughs> statue to the awards ceremony both showed that he cannot control his temper. What if they're brainwashing Bakugo right now, pulling him toward the path of evil? How can you sit there and tell us he still has a future? This reporter knows exactly what he's doing. Yeah. Yep. He's trying to antagonize us so he say something damning. You can't fall for it, Eraser. Eraser is not going to fall for it. He knows how much you hate the media. Oh. As Katsuki Bakugo's teacher, I take full responsibility for not taking That's a good answer. Mm. However, if the villains think they have a chance with him, then they are grossly mistaken. Yep. I yep. guarantee you that much. He'll never turn. That doesn't amount to real. We can't call any heroes away from the school. There's a bigger picture endeavor. <laughs> it's possible this incident is the beginning the of the end for Justice League. Society. Thanks to the tracking devices set by one of the students, we now believe there are two separate hideout locations. We know from our investigation. All team one and team two. Toshinari. If they're recruiting old men like me, then what are you suggesting? They're desperate. They're still Grand <laughs> We have the element of surprise. These villains will not succeed. At the press conference earlier, we had Principal Nezu act clueless to deceive the villains. Mm -hmm. He faked the villains on camera as if he didn't have leads. That's smart. That's true. Words, Instead of letting the, the press know that like they had a plan. We'll retaliate. Let's go, dude. Remind the world what you can do, heroes. Remind the world why you're heroes. I'm getting goosebumps. It's not crowded, but there are people around. So what's our next move? Toroki's hair kind of reminds me of Sasuke. It does. Adult Sasuke. The best chance it we does. have to get some this place. The place is pretty trashed. Doesn't look like... <laughs> hey, you okay? He saw no what's moves, wrong? huh? You weren't spotted, were you? No way. Yep. What's up, Saul? No. You think all for one is here? Master. Lend me your power. We're the, the factory. Yes. The factory. I thought you were the boss around here. Cause isn't he Unless like giving king. out powers to these nomus? I need to make an opening somehow and get to the back door. Oh. oh. I got a pizza delivery here. Pizza? pizza? Oh, it's the heroes, huh? You can't burn nothing, bitch. You can't run any more League of Villains, understand? Because I am here. Because we are here. Oh, we are here. here. Okay. After Shit. This conference, they had this ruse planned the whole time. Yeah, yeah, they fell for the press conference. You're surrounded by the police. Not to mention. Damn, that, that was perfect. That was awesome. Why does Ed Shot get to rush into the fight? <laughs> Never did it do shit. Because if someone slips out, we'll need you to capture them immediately. Ugh. 
<laughs> she hates being back up. Everyone's been restrained. There's no easy way to escape. Can they escape? They can't be helped. Kuro Giri, warp over as many as you can. The Nomu Rise. Oh! Oh, wait. No, the Nomu doesn't even matter. Yeah, because the other two. Yeah, teams they're died. there. Your little league underestimated all of us. The soul of this young man. The police. Just because they got the W, they got cocky. Mm -hmm. A righteous fury. Nice. nice. What a comeback from the heroes. Enough Let's fucking enough. go, dude. Your game has come to an end. I feel like this is going all too well, though. I mean, like. The last couple episodes was a W for the villains. I it's know. time for the heroes to get it. What happened? Did they kill him? I played around with his insides and made him fall unconscious. He had to sleep. Yeah, because the dude kept calling him. You'll all be better off if you take us seriously. Shuichi Ikuchi, Himiko Toga. Genius. He knows all of them. Their names. Though they had little time and information, the police worked through the night to discover your true identities. Nice. Do you understand? So, Shigaraki. What else you got, Shigaraki? Where is your boss hiding? Yeah. Shigaraki! This is your fault! I hate you! Whoa! Whoa. What the fuck? How is that Where'd happening? they come from? What is this? Stop Kuragiri. He's still out. He's still out! Is this all for one? What the fuck? Again? What the hell? Why? How? No. Damn, dude! It, they're oh, everywhere. Oh. Dude, is it? This is probably all for one retaliating. It has to be. Why didn't they secure Bakugo already? I mean, All Might was right next to him. That was pretty much secured. Damn, dude. I thought this was an easy win for the heroes. See? It was going all too well. Is this where the warp thing came from? Because it says two minutes earlier. Has to be. Oh, there's, there's Ragdoll. Look at her. What have they done to you? Whoa! What's going on? She's all naked. We this is great. She looks all like let's get back home. Out of it. To <sighs> Maybe he is here. You're right. A moment of hesitation could decide the fight. We can't let these villains try anything. Nice, best genius on the case. It didn't he matter. Didn't know much. What the hell? He just leveled that building? Oh, after credit. Let's go, baby. Damn, he leveled the whole place. Yeah. Tomura has finally started thinking rationally and Are they all dead? Oh, crap. And in that moment, this man made us feel death. We could see him. Oh, my God. What is this? Dude, they, they can't see. They can't get caught right now. They really can't, otherwise they're dead. This is now then. Shall we begin? Crap. Damn, are all the heroes dead? Here's the preview. This was such an amazing episode. Yeah. Like it really probably was. one of my favorites from the series so far. Cause it pretty much showcased the power and might of the heroes mm -hmm. if they take you on seriously mm -hmm. you know like if they see you as a legit threat they will come with Full everything force. they got at yeah. you and dude the way they went about this plan was amazing yeah like starting from the the, the, press the bar height yeah the press conference how they deceived the villains mm -hmm. right they, like they made them think that they didn't know jack shit they made them think that you know like they don't have something brewing yeah they made them think that they're still in the works yeah you know that like just to just to keep them safe you know just to keep them not to keep them safe but to to make the villains feel like they're safe that they're okay yeah and that, that, the, that the heroes aren't coming after them just yet and yeah and at the same time like handling the press yes making sure you keep your cool you don't 
you know, get baited with the mm -hmm. like tough questions. Yeah, you know, the they trigger handle, questions. Yeah, they handle themselves really well. Mm -hmm. And then from there to the bar, how like they fucking came in like the FBI. Yeah, like SWAT. <laughs> Yo. Like they restrained everyone. In an instant. Yeah, like, sh what's his name? Tomura Shigaraki couldn't do jack shit, dude. Mm -hmm. He kept calling to the warp warp gate guy, but the heroes had like a plan after yeah. plan. They knew, they knew that he was their ticket out. Yeah. So they had a hero that specifically Kamui. designed to be able to like negate that. Restrain him Restrain and then him. the, and the then... dude knocked him out. Mm -hmm. the, the dude that looks like a ninja. Yeah. Yeah. So like just just that like, and then, everything was amazing and then all might secured bakugo because mm -hmm. he's all might once he got you you're pretty much safe from that on right that's why like i i felt comfortable from that point on because like that's it dude this is an easy w i know and then because they even got the factory mm -hmm. where, where they the have nomus. all the nomus because that was another contingency from Tomura Shigaraki, right? Yeah. He was gonna call the Nomus, mm -hmm. but nah, the heroes got that too. Yeah, and they're striking at the same time. Yeah. That's why it was a pretty much guaranteed W. There was nothing bad gonna happen. But the thing is for me, once they kept asking, where's All For One? Yeah, Where that is was, he? that was, And then yeah. with Shigaraki like thinking and just like he, yeah, it, it seemed like he was in a state of panic too, right? He, like I, like you said, he kept calling out for the warp guy and just, just those few moments, like I didn't feel content anymore. I mm. didn't feel safe. I was like, shit, like something is gonna happen. This was like all too easy. And the fact that of course, Shigaraki's not gonna give up all for one. For me, it was because I felt comfortable because like the past few episodes were like wins for the villains, mm -hmm. right? So I thought, okay, so now this it's the hero's, hero's turn, turn to shine. But their 15 seconds of fame didn't last. They're literally 15 seconds. Because all for one stepped in and was like, yo, fuck you. Like, I'm taking this shit back. Yeah. All right, your comeback is over. Yeah. Like it's like five seconds left in the clock, and all for one came in with the clutch. That's insane. Like I, I we still scary. don't know how those no moves got warped in there, but we're assuming it has. We're to assuming be all he for had. One. Yeah, all for one was. He involved. has to have because who else could have done it besides yeah. the warp guy and. All the for warp, one. The warp guy was knocked out. Yeah, so. exactly. And then all for one is the only essential person villain there villain there that has pretty much unlimited powers or quirks yeah and has numerous quirks up his sleeve literally yeah. so th it's the only explanation for the other warps coming in for the nomos coming in like that has to be all for one yeah because all for one blew up wherever they were right so so the heroes are pretty much out of the picture yeah. and then the nomos are still there so he would have transported all of them. Mm -hmm. Like the question still remains: Are the heroes still good? You. <laughs> <laughs> are the heroes still alive? Yeah. Like I'm pretty sure they're still alive because. But they're this just is, badly injured. Yeah, because this show's not about like murdering all the heroes all at once, you know. Yo, they got to ragdoll. Yeah, and she literally I don't know what looks the fuck like they did. a ragdoll. What is her quirk again? Search, it said. Search? So I don't know exactly what that means. It said search. Wait, is she like that? Cause all, all for, for one, one took, took her, her powers? powers. Why was she naked? That's what I'm wondering. Like she was in a towel, like yeah. goddamn, what the fuck did all for one do to her? Right? Like you don't I don't think you need to be naked to take somebody's <laughs> powers. Yeah, bro. dude. Damn. Like if he did something else, then that's another story. So that pretty much crossed out that she's the mole. Mm -hmm. Cause I've been like, you know, suspecting her because where the fuck did she go? She but was unconscious. Yeah. She's literally, she really is like out of it. Yeah. Like she looks like she got blown away mentally. Like her mind looks like it's shattered in pieces. Yeah. Is the way that like her expression is. 
Because the mole has to be either from the faculty or the pussycat dolls. Yeah. <laughs> right? So, but and then Ragdoll was the only one missing. That's why I had the, the theory, food. but it's yeah. not her. I still, so we it, still don't know who, who the, the fucking mole, mole is. is, dude. That's this another thing great. that they need it, to get under control and yeah, quick. Yeah, because it's not predictable at all. It's not. Like, you still have no idea. But the only thing is, Deku and the squad are in some deep shit. Mm -hmm. They really They're are. They're all, in the epicenter. All one is right there. Yeah. They're in ground zero of all this, dude. Yeah. Like, all for one, like you said, is right there. He's if he like spots two, them, that's he it. could easily kill all of them. He could kill, like, All Might's protege, All yeah. Might's, like, future. Mm -hmm. You know? And, like, just the fact that he's. Just the fact that he's this powerful. Yeah. Like, I knew he was scary, powerful, but not. This fucking not this scary, showed it to the audience what powerful, he could do. Yeah. Yeah, like this like, pretty much showed, me. showed everyone that this is what the heroes are dealing with. This is your big bad. Like you should fear him. Oh yeah. You if know? you haven't feared him already, yeah. now's a good time to start. Yeah. <laughs> Cause he's fucking scary. This is the dude that injured the number one hero badly. And, and killed the predecessor. Yeah. And how many other predecessors before that? Yeah. This dude. And he's still alive after all these fucking mm -hmm. years. Like, yo. Yeah, I'm like, when I saw him and when he did that, when he like leveled that building, yeah. I just got like goosebumps. Yeah. I felt like my heart sink because yeah. of the, the heroes, like what's what happened to them. Mm -hmm. Like I'm I haven't felt this terrified of a villain in a long ass time. Yeah, I'm thinking of like other um, like anime villains and this dude is up there in terms of like scary. scare meter. Yeah. Scare meter, like he's up there because I can't think of anyone really, that's as scary as I really as cannot him. think of anybody that Madara really had was me a, shaking. Madara was in the scary Obito, no. No, Obito, no. Like who else? None of the Black Clover villains. No. Oh, like the the Eye of Midnight, no. Dragon Ball villains, no. no. Like, like I any, any... bleach, like no. Aizen's not this terrifying. Aizen's terrifying, not this terrifying. Yeah, he is, but like you said, not this level. Like if if All for One did not exist, I think the cake would go to Aizen. Yeah. Right, as most like terrifying. Because the way Aizen's very smart and cunning, mm -hmm. just like All For One is, but All For One has the power to back that up. So yeah, like definitely I, I want to say that like this is it. Like as, in terms of scariest villains, All For One definitely has the cake. Anyways, that's going to be it for this episode. Let us know your thoughts in the comments down below. I'm Danny. I'm Ray. And we'll see you guys in the next video.